Okay, here we go. This is us looking inside a 1.4 TSI engine. Uh, just having a quick look at the injectors in each cylinder as we go by. Uh, pretty difficult to get a good view of the injector because it's up inside the chamber in the top of the head. Uh, but you can see there's quite a bit of carbon buildup, even at this low mileage, which is 6,000. Uh, there's a strange dark patch in the middle of the injector. Uh, but this is mainly due to the fact that the nozzles are around the outer edge. Uh, pretty harsh environment for a fuel injector. Uh, and you can see that the surface looks quite sort of pitted already. But all four injectors look very similar. Uh, nothing really unusual about this. Okay, now we go back into the engine and we're going to have a bit of a look around inside the bore. You can see the spiral marks, which is the honing. Uh, this all looks really good, uh, exactly what you'd expect to see in an engine of this age. What is peculiar is the exhaust valves in number one cylinder are this really strange orangey red colour. Uh, they're only this colour in this cylinder. Uh, which would indicate some kind of fueling problem. Um, but it looks like the valves have been getting very hot, to be honest. Uh, everything else looks perfectly fine. The inlet valves have got a, a sort of a fairly black coke on them. See, number two cylinder, the valves look great. Uh, they're the usual sort of biscuity colour. Quick clean of the camera. Always getting bits and pieces on the end of the lens and doesn't show up very well. Okay, you can see some of the pitting on the exhaust valves. Uh, this is again fairly normal for just about any engine. There's always a bit of a bit of uh, uh, on the valve seat itself. There's always some pitting. Um, what is quite difficult to see in some cases is around the walls of the cylinder head. This next cylinder, this is number four, uh, number three, sorry. Uh, there we go, it's the exhaust valves. You can see the carbon build up on the cylinder head, it's quite black. Um, but around the sides of the head, the chamber, they're actually very clean. Very definitely very shiny. Have a quick clean. Just about to see the injector on the left. This mark around the top edge of the bore is quite normal. You can actually see the head gasket, which is the line, the horizontal line across just under underneath the injector. Turn the camera around a bit. You can see the top of the valve. These valves are closed. Inlet. Can you see the cleanness of the back wall of the piston chamber? There, the head chamber. It's very clean. It's the same on both sides of the chamber. Uh, again, slight tinge to those valves, but nowhere near as red as number one cylinder. Again, the clean wash on the side. Right, now number four, we get to see the inlet valves. Inlet valves are open. There's quite a lot of carbon deposit on the inlet valves already, even at this mileage. It's quite thick. Uh, this is quite common in direct injection petrol engines uh, because obviously there's no, the fuel isn't being sprayed down the inlet and therefore isn't washing the inlet valves. Bores again, really good. No score marks, no vertical score marks, just these lovely spirally hashing, patching lines. Uh, 
which is from the honing process. Nice exhaust valves again. There we go.